Welcome back to the vlog everybody. This week I really am doing it differently and I'm working with a plan. Despite the plan, I get spooked by something I was perfectly prepared for. Chris and I flash up the main propulsion machinery as we spin the ship through 180 degrees to bring the port side alongside. And then I get to enjoy that rarest of things on the night watch, some sunshine. And before you go, please could you help me grow the channel by clicking like or subscribe. I have just spent what feels like hours uh, going around and finding quick closing valves, marking their position so that uh, once I've activated them, I can go back and set them as they were. So basically on the fuel system, we've got um, quick closing valves, not just on the fuel system. Um, so fuel, lube, after. Um, and basically in an emergency, we can pull a valve handle and uh, it will close the valve at the tank. I'm gonna go and do these fuel, uh, start doing the valves on the port side. I don't know if there's gonna be any alarms, but that's what I'm up to. Okay. I, don't, I don't think there's gonna be any alarms, but I don't know. Group one, service domain engine, one. There goes nothing. The block has dropped, excellent. Which means I can run upstairs, reset the valve, and then or reset the activation handle. Uh, I'm just down here, mate. That didn't go. Chris? Yeah. Can you go and set that off again? Yeah. Fuck. No. I the pin's gone, but the valve hasn't dropped. Are you up there, mate? Yeah. Okay. Can you reset it? Yeah. And then set it off again. Sorry, buddy. That went off. Happy days. Do you want to do group two? Three. Two. Group two. Two. Excellent. Excellent. Absolutely have not been eating biscuits. Two more here. And then I think that's going to be it for the port side for today. God. Right. All right, come on, Jonathan. Wake up. What time is it? Storage tank. Find the rest of them first. Shit, I need a pen now, don't I? Bugger. To be resumed shortly. Good morning, everybody. Uh, so, Yesterday, I was doing quick closing valves. Today, I'm still doing quick closing valves, which is excellent. It's one down, only like 10 more to go. Hang on. Three, six, nine, 12, 13, 30. Mark it down, Jonathan. Mark it down. I've set them off. I can happily report that all of the quick placing valves on the port side are now done. Call it a day for there, which is kind of nice because it's approaching four o'clock in the morning, which is coffee time, halfway. This is one thing. Boiler suits are phenomenally practical pieces of clothing, but they have so many pockets like putting something into a black hole. You never quite know which one. You've put your notes, pens, tools, whatever, into. I have a suspicion Chris might be working on a fan. Could be wrong. A channel. To be fair, if you suggest it to one of them, they'll both fucking stay like. Yeah. So there aren't really many other times that you've got where you've got. I think, I think they're still cooking during the, like. Yeah, during the day. Welcome to a new watch, new day. Uh, well, not technically a new day. It's four o'clock in the morning. This morning, we're gonna swing the ship round 180 degrees to face the other way. Basically get the, uh, get the, hang on, let me think about this, port side of the ship alongside the quay. Um, that, that obviously involves having all the propulsion machinery running. So just running through that checklist. 
I've already done a couple of things, but what I have to do now is go out to number two hold and make sure that we've got oil in the starboard side stern tube header tank. God. You should say in the job description for marine engineer, contortionist with lots of hands. that. Improvise, adapt and overcome. Excellent. Right, so this thing is the uh, header tank for the port side stern tube. Now I'm going to top it up with oil basically. Ordinarily this would be sort of under pressure. There's a pressure regulating valve that puts compressed air up on top. Shut up Jonathan. As always, thanks so much for watching. I do hope you've enjoyed everything that you've seen. Um, I enjoy editing these videos a great deal, as weird as that might sound. But before I say goodbye this time, please can I ask for a small favour? Please could you hit that thumbs up button. Take care. I'll catch you in the next one.